Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? YouTube, knife enthusiast, knife lovers, something like that we are, aren't we? What are we? We're knife lovers, knife enthusiasts, knife hobbyists. We do something with knives, don't we? I don't know. But anyway, that was just a fast little, uh, that was just a fast little something. Oh my God. Here we go. Every time I, I have it all planned out before I turn this stupid camera on, my words flow just perfectly. Everything flows beautifully. Um, everything flows beautifully like Big Red EDC. You know what I mean? He shoots a video and his words just flow right out of his mouth like like a flower, you know what I mean? He, it's like he, he planned the video for days on end. You know what I mean? I turn the camera on and I get all... I'm listening to myself and I'm like, this is so stupid. All right, that's that. So anyway, guys, remember how I just did a video a couple uh, last week or whenever it was on the knife? that impressed you the most throughout the year and I mean guys uh, this knife here it's gonna it's gonna take time I got this knife from DH gate right love them knives turned me on to this knife so I stumbled across his channel and like normal we find the knife that we like and we have to order it so this one I looked at it and I was like, oh my God, I, I got to have that knife. I, I got, there's no two ways about it. I got to have it. And the way he talked about it and the way it was going down, I was like, all right, I'll order it for 50 bucks. 50 bucks, guys. Yeah, 50 bucks. D2 steel. Apparently it's titanium. We don't know. We don't care. But it's just a banging knife. It's just a banging knife for 50 bones. So, this is another one of my shockers, shockers, and when I got it out of box, listen to it, <laughs> guys, this is, I swear to God, this is like a $400 hinderer, this is, this is better than a hinderer, it's riding on ceramic bearings, let's take a look at it, milled, look at the milled clip on it, um, uh, Oh my God, hardened steel insert, frame lock. Let's check centering. Centering right down the pike on it. Flipper, bink, shoots right out there in a hurry. Snappy, um, just disengages with ease. Look at the butterness on it. It's just, you don't feel that blade shutting into the scales. Look, I'm gonna try and get that, that uh, knife near the mic more, listen. Wait, when it snaps in. <laughs> Yo, guys, we're talking 50 bucks here, okay? You want to talk about, that's not a shocker? If you got that, that wouldn't be a shocker. Guys, holy smokes. Now, they have another one. They have a couple of them. Um, this is the X-Series. Okay, this is the X series. Now you gotta go, you, you just gotta type this in. When you get the DH gate. Uh, YX, come on, focus for me. 650. Okay, that's what you type in. Um, and I'm telling you, you will think that you have a $400 knife in your hand. You think Microtechs are good? Yo, I'll put this up against a Microtech. Put this, I'll put this knife up against any high-end knife within reason, within reason now, that you could possibly think of. Seriously, I forget the number of the other one. Um, this is the 650. I think the other one, it's got a different blade shape. I want to get that one too. The other blade shape, I think it might be a 450 or something like that, but... 
guys, I, I, I did a little, I did a little video on this when I first got it, but here's the box, okay, this is what you're getting, it says, um, Jan Xvandia, it's the X series, Von X, um, Xvandia, but anyway, it's a slide, uh, it slides out, okay, and then you got the norm. Oh, I forgot to show you guys. The, look at that. They give you an extra set. They give you an extra set of ceramic bearings with it. There they are. You get a um, little um, a little holder for the for a little baggie. Um, like um, yeah, that's that's what you get. Not bad. You know what I mean. Um, so that's the packaging that comes with it, but guys, I can't stress enough. What more do you want to see besides action? And I mean, the sharpness, I strapped it, right? When I got it, let me see. When I got it, this D2, it cut, it was cutting. Guys, I cannot, that D2 right there is so let me see if i could guys it is as sharp look at the blade style look at the blade shape okay okay look at everything let's look at it let's go carefully now we'll start we'll start back here we're gonna go way up way up uh hold on a minute i hope i'm not making everybody dizzy here but check the blade out on that puppy there. Guys, I'm not lying. This is a $50 knife. This is a $50 knife. And when it when I give you when I say when I give you the explanation on buttery, it's like there's butter. You don't hear that blade. You don't feel it neither until it just it clicks, man. It's got that. It's got that expensive, authoritative click. This is a premium, premium knife for fifty bucks. Now, remember yesterday I shot a video on my magazine blade. Um, I was touching. I touched on save your money now in twenty twenty. It's going to be the knives are coming out hot and heavy. The uh, budget blades. Well, look, we're not even in uh, 2020 yet. This knife has been around. And it already has ceramic bearings in it, titanium scales, D2, um, D2 blade, all right? Now, perfect example of what is coming, okay? If you think, I'm just saying, you don't have to think this is any good, but if you do think that this is any good, Yo, guys, wait till you see what is coming in 2020. I'm telling you, it's unbelievable. I can't stress enough in the 50, this was 50 bucks. Let's say in the 50, let's just shoot for $50 price point in 2020. What you're going to be able to get quality wise, quality wise in 2020. Oh my God, They're, I, it's just unbelievable. But guys, yeah, I, I, I just had to do a video on this one. This was my, I mean, this is one of my big, big, big shockers when I got this. But I knew it was going to be good because the way Love Those Knives was talking about this blade and the way he was working the action and everything, I said, that I, I got to get that knife. You know what I mean? There's no way. I knew it was going to be good. Just by the way, I saw his knife. I knew what it was. But but just playing with it, I was like, holy smokes. This thing is just... I'm telling you, it's got quality of a $400 piece. It's the... There's there's nothing missing on quality. The quality is there. The steel might be... On a $400 knife, you might get M390. You're getting D2 on this. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, man. Guys, please, for heaven's sakes, 
please let me know what you think. I've done a video on this before. I don't really remember if I got much feedback on it. I really don't think I did. I really do not think that many people really was interested in this knife. I don't think so. And I, I just, it's just mind boggling to me. I don't know. But maybe he's dead. But anyway, furthermore, shoot me a jingle. Let me know below in the comments what you guys think about this piece. This DH gate, let's stress it again, $50 knife. And it's not, it's not real heavy, but it's that heaviness that, 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 it makes you know you got a nice knife in your pocket. You know what I mean? It's that kind of heaviness. So, guys, please, in the comments, shoot me a jingle. Let me know what you think. You know I like sitting on my couch and shooting a breeze with you and just saying hello to all my knife buddies out there. Okay? I appreciate it. You know what I mean? I, I sit down there and I got the pups laying down there with me and I... I read the comments, and this is what we knife people do. All right, guys. Yo, let me know what you think about this piece. This is my this is one of my shockers of uh, 2019, and uh, it, it was just a major. I mean, it was just that's just it's always going to be mind boggling every time I carry it. I mean, just for the money. Uh, if you if I told anybody if I pulled this out of my pocket and said, guess how much this knife was. Even a knife enthusiast, if you didn't know, you would think that this knife was more than 50 bucks. Come on, guys. You just didn't even play with it yet. All right, yo, guys. Uh, happy holidays, man. Merry Christmas. And uh, like I said, man, shoot me a little comment and uh, let me know what you think about this piece then. All right. Take her easy. Later.